think the most influential person to me has been my uh, principal investigator and mentor, um, Professor Pingshan Wang. He took me in before I was a freshman uh, at the, in the, during the Eureka program um, as my research advisor and he's been with me for the past about four years and ever since um, he's been the most influential person to me. I think my proudest moment was when we pulled together the Pride March um, in three days last year. Um, it was Clemson's first Pride March ever. It was something that really needed to happen and it was a great turnout. We had over 800 people show up and um, it, it was really just, just something that made all of us very happy, the organizers. I think I've changed in two major ways and the first is which I've, I've grown a lot thicker skin than I used to have and that's just a product of doing research. You have to be able to uh, take critique and um, go back and redo things when you need to and be able to resist tough challenges. Um, and I think the other uh, major change that I've gone through is I've also really learned to dream big. And coming into Clemson, I, I also had big dreams like any other Clemson student. But since going through research and, and courses and through my extracurriculars, I've learned that I could dream even bigger and go to graduate school and plan for my future. I came into Clemson early as a uh, participant of the Clemson Eureka program in Honors College and that gave me a summer before my freshman year to conduct research early and that was one of the toughest challenges I've ever faced. Um, since then I've chased even, even harder challenges and I think each time what motivates me is um, payoffs like these, like receiving the Samuel B. Earl Award and seeing my work make an impact in the field. Um, and so receiving this award, it, it, it really does mean a lot um, to show that the challenges I'm, I'm addressing are worth it.